The following is a rockradioshow.com exclusive. This is the undisputed future of WWE. Seth Rollins, and you are listening to The Rack on Wild Talk Radio. Welcome to the Rack Extra Views right here on WildTalkRadio.com. He's Rock, I'm Lindsay, and we're back with another book review, guys. And this time we are talking about the Ultimate Gamer's Cookbook, Recipes for an Epic Game Night by Andy Lanique. I'm excited about this. Do you want to know why I'm excited about this? Why? Because this is an entire cookbook of finger food. Basically, yeah. It is someone who entertains... And someone who looks for finger food recipes for said entertainment. This is clutch. It's cute as hell, too. But this is absolutely clutch for me. Like, I'm so excited to cook from this and try things from this. Because, number one, the recipes are really, really, really nice. There's a huge variety in this book. But two, a lot of them look fairly simple and they do. pretty straightforward to make. Like, this is something that a beginning beginner could do mm-hmm. and pretty much have no trouble with. Because what's nice is they have the basic recipes, and then they have recipes where you can do upgrades, where you can do something that's a little bit harder to enhance it and make it better. Yeah, you got side dishes, and then you got some, you know, appetizer type things. You got some snacks, which is always comes in clutch. Honestly, I was excited about the sandwich recipes. Yeah, they're cool. It's it's stupid to say that. Mm-hmm. It's really, really, really stupid to say that. But when you like open the book and it's like the first thing you see is they're talking about sandwiches and there's like you know frenzy finger sandwiches and you can have you know they have cucumber crab sandwiches in here which is very classy turkey apple like all these different type of sandwich types like including the strawberry and cheese. I was like ooh that sounds good you know and it's just like stuff in here. That you're like, yes, yes, all of this, yes, this is perfect. Because Mm -hmm. even if you're not entertaining and you just want to make yourself something really quick and simple and easy... For the, for those for those long gaming hours that you you do when you're playing Fortnite or COD or anything like that, Genshin. Um. Okay, Genshin yes. Impact as well. I'm just, I'm just put, pointing it out there. You you can have nice nice food. I mean, if you need comfort food when your summons go bad and you lose the fifty fifty, yeah, this is your book, guys. <laughs> right here, this is your book. You can hear you can hear me tapping it. Um, I I'm, I'm super thrilled about this. I can't wait to try stuff from it because. It just, it all looks yummy. And we have to talk about, too, the design of the book. They're on point. They're on theme. It has a gaming theme. It's punny as all get out. Oh, my God. The puns in these books are so great. So it's split up in different sections. You got Roll for Initiative, DLC, Turn turn Order Tarts, Stabby Stabby Stab. That's my favorite section right there. Yeah. The Stabby Stabby Stab, yeah. Yeah, that's my favorite section of the entire book. You have different sections with different types of food, and it has, as you mentioned, the varieties of them, but there's some great names in here. Just for the record, the Stabby Stabby Stab is all skewers. Yeah, which has past turn puffs. Uh, we got pancake skewers, peanut sauce skewers, druid snacks, you know, things like that. And everything's, like, set up perfectly. Like, the DLC is all dips. It's Yes, it's an entire section of, of dips. Dip. Yeah, which is great. Like, you have RNG jars, one-shot shrimp, NPC, non-problematic cheesecake. I want to try that. I want to try that really, really, really hard. Like, I saw that, and I was like, ooh, an easy-to-do cheesecake recipe. <laughs> ooh! Yeah. Let's go. So, like, it, it, this is a bright, colorful book. It shows you some great pictures to just show you what the food it looks like for most of them. And yeah, it the directions are very short, very simple. It's like it's anyone can use this book and cook some great food. Which is what you want. And the the ingredients, they're all easy to get. There's nothing like really super weird. Yes, there's like some classy things in here, like shrimp and crab. But there's also stuff that you know, it's like. Super simple. Like, there's, like, a ramen noodle recipe mm-hmm. in here. There's a there's a sheep. Like, you can actually make mutton. Wood for sheep. <laughs> you know, there's just... There's there's stuff in here that you can get, and then there's stuff that's, like, really easy to do. And 
overall, it's really nicely balanced. They did a wonderful job collecting the recipes, putting them together. I'm looking at the the non-problematic cheesecake right now. Like, just for an example, you know, it takes, like, Oreo cookies and lemon zest and lemon extract and other things in here. Like, it's all very, very easy to do. It's nothing, it's nothing terrifying or scary or difficult or anything like that. So I, I have to appreciate that. Ooh, the pancakes. Um, I'm putting the book down now. <laughs> Cause I'm going to get hungry. But yeah, I also love the mix of the matte and the gloss on the cover. Like the, the cover is great. It is a hard back book, which is very nice. You got great pictures on the back that are from the inside, but you know, it's just like Rock said. It's beautiful. It's colorful. It's bright. It's fun. It's punny and it's easy. It's simple, which in a very complicated world, that's what we want, right? Yeah. Easy and simple. So we have to send a big thank you to our friends over at Inside Editions and Simon and Schuster for this book. We very much appreciate uh, you guys sending it over for us to review. I cannot personally wait to cook from this. It should be fun. I actually, I actually wanted to do it um, before we did the review, and unfortunately things did not work out for me because work has been crazy. Um, but I am going to look forward to cooking from this, and I actually intend to do it and take pictures and put them out because my bad social media stuff. But I'm going to do the thing. I promise I'm going to do the thing. He's going to hold me to that, right? I, I will hold her to that, yes. Yeah, at he'll, he'll make me. At Lynn's word. Yeah, 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 exactly. So, any closing thoughts? No, it's a fun little book. Go out and buy it. It's available now on all fine bookstores, Amazon, Barnes & Noble, you name it. Go get the book. Make sure you follow us on social media at Lynn's word, at Wild Talk Radio, at Rock Radio Show. It's on the Twitters. Facebook.com says Wild Talk Radio Network. Facebook.com says Rock Radio Show. Make sure you follow us on Twitch, twitch.tv slash the retail live when the rock the full show is live at 10 p.m eastern every thursday night if you're listening to us we're celebrating 11 years tomorrow or today when you're listening to this so check it out 10 p.m eastern the rock turns 11 yes so tune in for all of that follow us do all the things i'm also live on twitch twitch.tv slash lens where i do game indeed so with that, we're going to go. I hope you guys enjoyed. He's Rock. I'm Lindsay. You've been listening to the Rec Extra Reviews right here on WildTalkRadio.com. It is the Ultimate Gamers Cookbook Edition, and we will see you later with another review very soon. Till then, bye! Wild Talk.